There I am in the backyard, hanging out. And I'm going to get ready to show you guys a video. It's a Pinewood Derby race of sluice mats. Everything's the same. Flow, pitch, angle, gold, size of gold, feed rate, the whole deal. And I had a competitor tell me today that my mat flat out didn't work. So this is going to be my response. This was a private video that I did on the first test. So I was pretty excited. I'm a pretty excitable guy. Pretty passionate guy. I love the race. And rubbing is racing. That's kind of how I feel about it. Um, I never meant this video to go public. It was more of a private video. So I'm going to edit parts of it. Bleep out some things and make it basically publicly, uh, politically correct. Or publicly correct. Um, but I'm going to show you guys how excitable I get on the first test of, you know, when we tested the Dream Mat and the Pinewood Derby thing. Not the test that we did on Idaho, which is a, at, right after that. But I'm, uh, I'm going to show people what we did for our first test and how excited I got and how surprised I was on the results. And I want to show, show the people, you guys out there, the genuine passion of what it's like when I win a race. And I try my best to design. I'm a mechanical designer. And when you feel like you've accomplished something uh, that's head and shoulders above, it's pretty exciting, especially when you got years into developing a product. And so here we are. We're going to go to the Bat Cave. Actually, the Mat Cave. And I'm going to show you guys what it looks like the first night that we got the test stand up and going and we gave it the first official test. And it's going to get pretty crazy. You guys are probably going to laugh. Um, that's okay. Have fun. But I hope you sense the true, genuine passion of a designer who is very excited about what he's accomplished. And I'm genuinely very appreciative of all the support and feedback I get from all my customers who love my product. And thank you. You guys make it worthwhile. Even though it was while the haters come in and they pop their little jab we all know that um uh results rule in their in racing sometimes there's only uh one winner unless there's a tie all right cool beans let's watch the video here we go gotta put the other mats in and do some uh Testing, we'll go grab a burger and then we're gonna put the other mats in and we're gonna do some testing. And the other runs. Got my super duper light test stand there. Woohoo! That's how we roll with the unicorn palace at the the at the mat cave. We are getting ready to do our test with our over an ounce of gold in each vial. Going to drop in there in the super shop with the headers hanging over the top of the super um, uh, test stand. So we got the dream mat. We got so we're just waiting for the epoxy to set up on these middle ones a little bit more. Then we're going to turn this thing on. We're going to dump that gold in this baby and we're going to see who is Give me the first losers that are going to come out in each one of those vials. Woohoo! Get ready. So here you go. Randy goes with the dumper. Ready? Yep. Dumper on, Randy. There the gold goes. Look at it all go. All right. All right, you lift up the dumper now, Randy. There's our gold. Here's our test. Who's the first loser? Ah! <laughs> already down to the bottom and losing gold already. All right, there's Dream Hat up at the top. We're already making it to the bottom. Doing better, but look at we're still making it to the bottom. Look at that. Look at that stuff. I mean, a lot of this stuff is above 30 dash. I mean, this is like. This is big stuff, some of this stuff. And that's big stuff at the bottom. Woo-hoo! Dream Matt! No, come over here! Where's the goal? Where's the goal? Where's the goal? Oh, there it is! It's all up by the top where it's supposed to be! Yo! Oh, I gotta say, the goal! Bullcrap marketing, man! We are kicking! 
get but we got light. It's doing pretty good, you know, for got deeper grooves. Now here, you know, now remember some of this gold is there's a, there's about there's about a uh, half a gram of beach gold in each one of these. So we got some. This is what we call the aftermath. Where's Dream Mat Gold? Let's take a look, guys. All right, all you prospectors out there. Come on, let's look at the Dream Mat Gold. Where's it at? Where's it at? Where's the stop? Okay. Let's keep going down. Okay, we are halfway down. What starts happening halfway down here? Gold kind of disappears. Not really happening no more. It isn't leaving the building. Well... We got gold all the way to the end. It's a miracle that it all stayed in the mat. Okay, here we got. Goes all the way down to the bottom. Look at that. Got a, look at that big gold. Getting ready to leave the building right there. Okay. Stacking up in there, stacking up in there, stacking up in there, stacking up in there. We got stuff getting ready to leave the building. Look at that. How come Dream Mat ain't got stuff in the end getting ready to leave the building?